track checking with the components. While repairing mobile phone, you should have all the understanding of various components and track checking connecting these components and different parts of mobile phone. Our objective is to make you learn repairing by giving concerned knowledge of internal structure of a mobile phone and make you expert in this field. As you all are aware, mobile phone is not a single part instrument but comprises of many small parts which intercommunicate to perform operation. Let us start with the identification process related to various components in mobile phone. A certain component part is easy to find with an assistance of symmetric diagram of mobile. The basic design of every mobile is same but the actual component of layout and positioning is different in different makes and models. You can see a listed part in the picture. The PCB of a mobile cell phone has a small part of an electric component. It must learn and understand how to identity these small part or electronic components and understand their function. Most of these electronic components are surface mount devices. They are made by surface mount technology is a method of producing electronic circuits in which the components are mounted or placed directly onto the surface of PCB. Let us begin with the introduction to this electronic component that a mobile phone has. A boost coil size is little bigger than coil. It is found in black color and mobile phone coil looks like large button. Its function is to increase current. Capacitor is one of the major components used in mobile phone. There are three types of capacitor found in mobile phone. Where non-electrolytic capacitor is found in any section of a mobile phone, its height is little more than a chip resistance. Another electrolytic capacitor which is found in mobile phone, its size is larger than electrolytic capacitor. It is found in two colors, orange with brown strip and black with white strip. It gives an indication that the slide with the strip is positive and the other side is negative. The third type is called as a network capacitor which is found in any section of a mobile phone. It is made from two or more non-electrolytic capacitor. Now what is coupler? It is an electronic component which is found in the network section of a mobile phone. It is either of black or white color and has a six pins bent inside. Its function is to filter network which is the coupler is faulty then there will be no network in the mobile phone. A diode is a two terminal electronic component with an asymmetric conductance. It has low resistance to current in one direction and high resistance in the other. It is classified as a rectifier diode which is found in black color and converts AC current to DC current. It passes current in one direction. It does not pass current in reverse direction. Other type is the Zener diode which is found in charging section. It filters and minimizes current and passes forward and acts as voltage regulator. LED is another type of diode which is found or, uh, in a white or light yellow color. It emits light such as mobile phone LED or a photo diode which is used for infrared. It captures infrared rays. A regulator is an electronic component which is found in any section of a mobile phone. It is of black color and has five or six legs. It performs function which filters current and regulates voltage. Chip resistance can be found in any section of a mobile phone. It is of black color. In some sets it is also found in blue and green color. It is the smallest electronic component on the PCB of a mobile phone. It decreases current and passes forward. Network resistance can be found in any section of a mobile phone. It is made up of two or more chip resistance. A transistor is an electronic component which is found in any section of a mobile phone. It is of black color and has three legs. It does the work of switching. You can see inside view over here. Moving on, next slide, let us have a look on components that are included in circuit for mobile phone. The analog to digital and digital to analog conversion chip translate the outgoing audio signal from analog to digital and the incoming signal from digital back to analog. The DSP that is digital signal processor is a highly customized processor designed to perform signal manipulation calculation at high speed. Microprocessor is also known as a CPU 
The microprocessor handles all of the housekeeping of uh, the keyboard and display, deals with command and control signaling with the base station and also coordinates the rest of the function on the board. Read-only memory is an integrated circuit program with specific data when it is manufactured. Read-only memory refers to memory that is hardwired such as diode matrix and later mask ROM. Although discrete circuit can be altered, ICs cannot and are useless if the data is bad. A ROM chip provides storage for the phone operating system and customizable feature. The radio frequency and the power section handles may power ma management and recharging and also deals with the 100 of FM channels. A circuit board with a SIM card on it is shown on your screen. SIM is an integrated circuit that securely stores the international mobile subscriber identity and the related key used to identify authenticate subscriber on mobile telephony devices. Mobile phone have such tiny speakers and microphones. The speaker is about the size of a dime and the microphone is no longer than the watch battery beside it. Speaker is the component that takes the electronic signal stored on things. A battery is used to provide power supply to the PCB circuits and components. There are various types of batteries in each particular mobile phone product and varies to each size and specifications. Manufacturers coded each particular packet according to size and where specified product to use. Battery connector. This is the interface where the battery connects and supplies the voltage to the cell. Antennas are used to intercept and boost network signals. Without it, the phone will hardly connect to service provider and result network signal lost. They also consist of many types and size and varieties. It varies according to how each manufacturer design. It is made of thin brass or stainless metal mounted on a plastic packaging. Now you can see a camera module used in mobile phone. It is the component used to capture and store images. What are plug in connectors? These are interfaces used in charging or by charger plugging. The front and back side look like shown in the images. Flex cable are also called flex wire, other also called ribbon wire. These are made into a flat thin wire used as an interface to connect from one circuit or component. It is called flex means flexible other also called it a ribbon wire. Let us study about touch panels. Touch panels navigate everywhere on LCD screen by just using a finger. They are made of flat thin glasses which is designated with a high capacitive value. A microphone is also known as a mouthpiece. It converts sound in air into electrical signal. There are tiny electric motor inside the cell phone attached to the motor. It is an off-center weight when the motor spins the weight vibrate much like a car. This component is also called as vibrator. Thank you.